Hi guys, welcome back, it's Angie and this is our final video from the video series we create about Advanced Product Options app and creation of an option set. We already created options them themselves, we created rules for them and today uh, we will talk about assignment of our test set to products. So we will visit uh, the products tab to assign um, set two products and here you can see two options you can assign uh, a set to products manually or automatically so if you select manually it's quite straightforward there is no there are no limitations you just need to uh, select the required products manually from the list and click save okay uh, to uh, group the assigned products you can um, add filter here show assigned products and you will see the assigned products only it's quite easy okay uh, the second option automatically and here you can assign an option set to products by conditions uh, we offer three types of conditions so, uh, they can be based on product type vendor and tag okay if you select product type uh, expand the menu you uh, the available option types will be auto populated here uh, you can select one and click add filter Okay, uh, you've got this condition and the product that meets that condition. Now, if you click save, our option set will be assigned to that product that corresponds to our condition. Uh, please keep in mind that if you add more conditions, for example, you would like to add another product type, men's, let's say, add filter, you will get this condition showing up here and you will get the product that meets the condition. But uh, unfortunately, um, the um, set won't work for those products because our app um, uses the all condition type. So I mean, uh, it will look for a product that meets both conditions at the same time. But since a product can't, uh, can't have uh, two types, uh, two product types assigned at the same time, back and men's, so uh, there won't be any options showing up on the product page of these two products. Uh, we'd recommend creating a separate state for each product type if you need uh, to assign uh, options to products by, by product type. Okay, this is it. After you uh, assigned, find the right way to assign product to the set, you just need to save it and make sure you enable the set itself before testing. Enable set, click enable, and feel free to check the changes, the options we created on the front end of the assigned um, product page. Thank you for your attention. Have a great day. Um, I hope this video guide will be useful. Goodbye.